Okay, so we're doing... <laughs> hey, guys. Hi, YouTube. <laughs> this is my sister-in-law, Elena. We're doing... <laughs> this is her page. My name is Haley. I'm a guest, a guest on tonight's ASMR. Our wine review for tonight. Our wine review for tonight is an Italian wine. So tonight is, so this was a gift I got today from, um, to, <laughs> you have to, okay, um, so I got, um, this wine today is a Christmas gift from a, um, two of the people that, uh, report to me. One is pregnant, so she said to enjoy this bottle mm -hmm. um, thoroughly. She loves wine, so I suspect this is going to be a delightful blend, maybe beyond our palates. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. Probably. <laughs> so, how do we say the name? Avignonesi. 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 Vino Nobilo. Mm -hmm. Di Monte Ponciano. Ponciano. Mm -hmm. um, Italian. Okay, so I'll work on opening it if you want to. I'll read these wine maker notes. So the nice thing about having somebody do this wine review with me is that we can actually share a bit more about the wine maker notes instead of just my interesting descriptions. Okay, um, so before we taste it, it's the wine maker note says. It, you're going to experience intense aromas of fresh red fruits and forest floor with a touch <laughs> forest. of sweet spices. Forest floor. So I'm assuming that's very like twiggy. <laughs> Probably twiggy. I'm actually kind of concerned. A little about bit this. acorn, perhaps? Oh, maybe like an acorn. So the taste is a medium, medium bodied, round, and elegant, with silky. Tannins. Mm, I'm not sure what tannins is. And a long lasting finish. Oh, and oh, and it's critically critical, critically acclaimed. Mm. So it might be a bit chaotic with tonight's wine review because we're also it's Christmas Eve and we're at my mom's house. And we have my sister in law's dog, Asher. You can probably see her tail. <laughs> And then we also have Blue here too. Blue's here. He's got a cone on. His good is camp. His uh, surgery to get his cancer. And we have Brandy. <laughs> Brandy hasn't made an appearance all night, and apparently she wants to be on this YouTube video. For... ASMR star. Yeah, she wants to be. Actually, she'd probably be a really good one because she really doesn't hear a lot. Oh God, this 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 is not going well. Oh no. What the hell? Recording us tonight. It's quite the treat. It's coming. It came off the sound. Can we just pull it out? It's really sweaty. We just got back from the dog walk. <laughs> We need to call our guest, Michael. If you Michael, here we'll do a close up of the. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you're good at that. Because I mean, it focuses, I guess. Yeah. Okay, this is my brother, Michael. Oh! Jeez, we gotta get we gotta get my mom a new corkscrew. Would you like to take the first whip? Well, no, you just turned 30, so I think you should do it. Oh, a whip. Yeah. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. It does. It smells a little bit smoky. Maybe? It smells like a forest floor. <laughs> twiggy. It's <laughs> twiggy. It smells a bit twiggy. And it has the good bottom. I oh, yes. Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. 
Okay, okay, before we pour this though, I just want to show you guys my cup. It says a vintage 1989 aged perfection. I got this for my birthday. Can you make it? <laughs> so this, is, this is my first time using it. Really? Yeah, I haven't used mm. it. Yeah. So we'll see how it looks. Okay. I don't think it's any different than the regular one box, but I don't know, it's vintage though. So do you think oh, it's yeah. a nice pour if it's a good so usually I use a straw, but this time we're just gonna have to drink and get our teeth. Red wine, we can whiten them later. Yeah, we can whiten them later. We're gonna stay up all night long, I think. I think so too. <laughs> um, so tomorrow we're FaceTiming our nieces for Christmas. Yeah. Oh, it's Christmas Eve, by the way. Okay. So, I can't really smell anything. Can you? I can, yeah. That smells nice. Full bodied. How come you can smell it? I can't smell it. Is it my teacup? I don't think so. Can I smell? Mm -hmm. Yeah, try one. Okay. Oh yeah, that's weird. There's mm -hmm. some smell. Maybe it's because it, this was the first pour? Maybe the first pour? Yeah. Okay, well, let me give this taste and we can describe it. Mm. It's really smooth. That is very smooth. Like, I think I could pound this whole glass. Probably, yeah. Yeah. This case is as if then red fruits and forest floor. Like, I don't taste the floor, forest floor, do you? No. Oh, it also says, oh, do you eat any of the fish? Maybe? It says that it might have some more fish. Maybe my palate's off because I was up all night driving to you. <laughs> she drove all night. I drove all night. Wrong turn after my mom gave me the wrong directions. No, no, no. I did not give you the wrong direction. Yeah, I missed an hour on the trip. Oh, hi. Oh. Snacking as usual. Oh, sorry. I don't okay. want to touch okay, your stars. Okay. okay. Down you go. Down you go. Thank you. Thank oh, you for making your appearance. Okay. Thank you. Get down. Blue. I'm scared Get to down. touch your incisions. I don't know. Okay. Back to our line. Okay. We're going to do another taste. Yeah. We don't figure out what, like, because it's supposed to be a lingering mm -hmm. under taste. Do you find it lingered? No, this is really good wine. Like, the really good. Mm -hmm. This is a... Why don't I remember this bottle, eh? Like, I'm not gonna lie, this tastes like most better wines that I've drank. <laughs> what do you, what would you take this wine to? Um... Merry Christmas, friend. Oh, it doesn't matter. Hey, can I try it out your glass? Sure. Yeah. Maybe it tastes different than a teacup. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is a big teacup. I know. It's such a nice, like, yeah. I would take it to a tea party. And this time for me, yeah, it's so tea. I drink this wine. Eat little sandwiches. Like those little sandwiches where you cut off the heads. Like, maybe it's just in our head, but yeah, this does taste different coming out of a teacup. Oh, it tastes so much different. Maybe because it's coming in more like air, more maybe it's got like more air. Maybe. On the science behind it. Why not? So it's probably a but like, it sure does. I like drinking out of a teacup though, because you can just. No, that was my, like my throat. Oh, okay, that's my nipples. I have a bunch of bubbles. So. Okay, I would take this wine to a tea party. Not that I go to any tea parties. So I actually would take this wine out to drink with you. Yeah. I think like, I would gift it to like oh, it's a good one to gift. Older couple. Oh, do you mind? That have a younger couple. Do my do my do Nicola body I think I'm a mature older person? Oh, this is also 2014. And most wines are like, aren't they? Like 2016, like yeah, I don't know. This might be like a matured. Oh, if you ever buy wine that's more than older than two years, <laughs> it's more than twelve dollars a bottle. Yeah, this is true. This is true. Yeah. We don't know the price on this. It was a gift, so. Oh, I think it says what was younger. Oh, okay. I don't think I'm a mature older person. You hope not. I hope not. How are you? Twenty-seven ninety. Jesus. Yeah. Okay, so most of our reviews, I try to keep the price point under 20 bucks. Oh, so other people can like, 
the other way? Yeah, yeah. the port, but from this way. I also try to get the wine, um, like stuff like this on sale. So knowing Nicole, that she maybe got this on sale at Superstore. We have cork. I don't know if this would ever, would, I don't know if I've seen it at Superstore. Oh, it's like a legit liquor store. That probably like wine game. Why don't they have that in Calgary? I'm not sure, but I went there today and there's so many wines. Like I was there for a half hour. Mm. And I just got the same wines I usually do. Because I don't have a lot of it. Mm. We should get a wine so game together. Need, yeah. This is why we need these videos. So so we can like keep track of the ones we get ourselves. Yeah. And some people find calming. Calmness. to mature older couple mm -hmm. I would drink this with you or maybe like I would drink this if we were going to go shopping because Michael would drop this off yeah that should be good okay. this would yeah. go good in like a little tumbler to go up. yeah just one sec <coughs> we're just getting all the noises today um, do you also like do you rate do you do like a a rating a rating on a no. Between one and ten. So yeah. far, my favorite is bread and butter Chardonnay. Oh. And then I like Cheeky Monkey Red. Oh. I think it's Red Wine Blend. I so think I have a. We could do like more than one. So tomorrow, okay, we should do a Christmas day meal now. A Christmas special. We'll do a Christmas special for everybody. Yeah. So my recommendation is I would take this drop shopping midday with a girlfriend. Get a DD, aka my brother or husband. And I would give this to a much older, well, not much older, maybe like 40s, 50s, 50s, 50s probably, mature couple. That's a gift, and I've got a ball for you. Maybe with some chocolate. Mm, okay. Mm -hmm. um, so we will come back tomorrow with some more wine review because we brought, I think, between the two of us, 18 bottles of wine. Yeah. Um, so we can do sure a did. series. You can be a guest on it. Okay. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully my mom is okay for recording it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um. Thank you, and uh, we love you. We love you. Happy Christmas Eve. Happy Christmas Eve.